Zencam. In this video, we will show you how to enable and configure motion detection on your Zencam. We will also cover how to schedule recordings, set motion regions, and set up email alerts when motion detection is triggered. If you haven't already set up your Zencam on your Wi-Fi network using the Zencam mobile app and enabled device storage to record to your microSD card, please complete those steps prior to continuing with this tutorial. To get started, launch the Zencam app on your mobile device and tap on the thumbnail image for your camera. After the live view comes through, tap on the gear icon on the top right. Then tap on motion detection. Here you will see the motion detection settings. Tap on the motion detection option to enable it if it is not already enabled. From this screen, you can schedule recordings, adjust motion detection sensitivity, set regions, and enable or disable snapshots and email notifications. First, let's see how to schedule recordings. This was touched on briefly in the microSD card setup video, and we will go into further detail here. Go ahead and tap on Schedule. Here you will see a 7-day, 24-hour calendar. Since all Zencam cameras come set up by default for 24-7 recording, you will see all time slots shaded. To create your own scheduled recording times, tap the gear icon on the top right. Here you can customize the dates and times of your motion detection recording segments. You can start by selecting the day of your recording and copy or duplicate your selection for the whole entire week or for multiple days of the week. Then tap the save icon on the top right. You'll notice that the days you selected now appear on the schedule screen. You can create up to six different recording segments for these days. The first scheduled time segment is set by default for a 24 hour recording, which works for the majority of Zencam users. In certain situations, you may want motion detection to be deactivated and then reactivated later. For example, if you have your Zencam set up at your home and you don't want motion detection on when you come home for a one hour lunch break, you can set recording segment number one to start recording when you leave for work at say 7 a.m. and ends when you come home for lunch at 12 p.m. This way you don't record yourself eating, unless you really want to at which point the default 24-7 recording will work just fine for you. Next, you want motion detection to reactivate when you leave the house again to return to work after one hour. You can set recording segment number two to start recording at 1 p.m. and continue until you return home from work at 5 p.m. The camera will stop detecting motion after 5 p.m. until the following morning when recording segment number one starts up again at 7 a.m. Or, instead of stopping the recording at 5 p.m., you can keep motion detection recording on through the evening until 11.59 p.m., as it must end within the same 24-hour day. Then, to continue the recording overnight, you can set recording number 3 to start at midnight and continue until 6.59 a.m. Then, recording number 1 will pick back up at 7 a.m., so you will have every minute of motion detection recording covered. You have six recording segments to create the best customized motion detection recording scenario that works for your unique situation. Be sure to tap the save button to save your changes. Then tap the back button. When returning to the schedule screen, you will see the modifications that you've made on the 24-7 calendar. Tap back again to go back to the motion detection settings screen you'll see a message that your configuration has been saved successfully. Under Schedule, you can adjust the sensitivity of your camera's motion detection. The default setting of 60 works best for most Zencam users in most situations. You can change this number to your desired setting. The lower the sensitivity, the less likely it is for your camera to pick up or record motion. In other words, it will take a more significant amount of motion to trigger the camera's motion detection sensor. On the other hand, the higher the sensitivity, the more likely it is for your camera to pick up and record motion. Much less motion is needed to trigger the camera's motion detection sensor. 
Set regions can potentially be one of the most important settings linked with motion detection. This option lets you specify areas on the screen where motion detection is active and other empty spaces where it is not active. The entire viewable area is highlighted by default. To create your own zone, tap Clear Zone first. This setting lets you set activity zones for the camera to zero in on certain areas and avoid other spots. It is particularly useful if you are placing your ZenCam in a place where a constantly moving object like a ceiling fan or a tree branch is visible in the camera's field of view. This would constantly trigger the camera's motion detection and cause unwanted alerts. Also, having small children or house pets that travel low to the ground can also cause recurring false motion alerts. To help reduce the occurrence of these notifications, you can set activity zones that work best for you. If you have your camera set to monitor a specific area with windows or doors, you can highlight only those points of entry and leave other areas unselected. Only motion that is detected in the highlighted areas will be picked up by the camera. Below set regions, you will see toggle switches to enable snapshots and email notifications. The snapshots option lets you choose whether you want a quick snapshot to be taken whenever motion is detected. Snapshots will be saved along with recorded video under My Saved Files in the account menu. The email notifications option lets you choose whether you want the camera to send an email notification whenever motion is detected. Let's briefly see how to set up email notifications. Tap back to return to device information. Drag the screen up and you will see the email alerts option at the bottom. The email alerts screen lets you input your email information and choose how you want to receive email notifications. Select the email provider and the app will automatically fill in some of the fields for you. Next, enter in the email's username and the password. For sender, insert the email you are using to send. Authentication should be pre-filled based on your email provider. Next, create a subject for every email notification. For example, alert, motion detected. And finally, type in the email address for the recipients to whom you want to send notifications. One of the recipients will also need to be the same as the sender. The interval lets you choose how often or how many seconds between each notification to help reduce the frequency of emails from filling up your inbox. Keep Alive sends you an email notification letting you know that your camera is still online and is alive and well. You can choose to enable this alert if you want to always have confirmation that your camera is online. You can specify the number of seconds you would like between each Keep Alive alert, with a minimum of once per hour. Be sure to tap Save when you're finished setting up your email alerts. We hope this video has helped you discover how to set up motion detection on your ZenCam, as well as learn about other related features such as scheduling recordings, setting regions, and email notifications. To learn more about other ZenCam devices, please see our other video tutorials and subscribe to our channel to view our latest products and videos. Thank you for choosing ZenCam. Relax. Put peace in the palm of your hand.